it does add a tinge of sadness every time you cross. When she crosses the Deception Pass Bridge, Kelsey Flynn doesn't just see the beautiful view. She knows the depths of its despair. There have been some really, really, really dark times where I just felt like there was no way out. So, um... Kelsey has struggled with depression and known people who have succumbed to its darkness. That's why she and about a dozen others are placing rocks along the bridge painted with messages of hope. Uh, I know that if I had not had my support of my family and my friends and my faith in God that gave me hope, I wouldn't be here. So I wanted to share that through these rocks. If they can find a rock, maybe it will be a sign to them that there's greater things ahead. Kelsey and a bunch of concerned citizens formed a Facebook group dedicated to reducing suicides. Kelly Harold heads it up. If nothing else, she hopes the rocks will help start conversations with people considering suicide. Because the more people feel heard and understood and even are just able to talk openly about these things, the less power they actually have over us. Beside these rocks, a note from a mother to her son who apparently took his own life here, a pain she feels every day. Decades of sadness these folks are trying to help end. Sometimes it just takes like that split second, somebody saying the right thing or seeing something that just snaps you out of that place. Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.